Hi, welcome to my crafty corner. I am not the greatest at making videos, but I want to try to share some of my ideas with you. I love to recycle as much as I can, and uh, when I go uh, grocery shopping, I try I request um, paper bags instead of plastic. And you know, I want to be a little bit uh, environmentally friendly. And I actually ended up getting a whole bunch of paper bags and I didn't know what to do with them and I felt bad throwing them away. So I gave them a second chance. Not all of them, but I do have a whole bunch more to go through and I will be making some more stuff or trying to come up with more ideas. But so far, this is what I have been working on. So you can go from this bags. I used both, the ones with the handles and no handles. And I'm actually going to start over here. With this one, I started working on something that looks like this. So, this was my first project with paper. And uh, I really love how it came out. It's pretty sturdy because of the coatings I um, put on it. So, you can actually squeeze it like that. It won't break and it's pretty hard. I also did this one. This is my second paper project. And the same thing. This is pretty um, strong. I also did this little guy right here. This is from uh, junk mail, actually, or those magazines that you get um, constantly in the mail. And I also, this is also from a paper bag, grocery paper bag. Not perfect, but I was just trying to see if I could make something round. So that's those. And then the bags with the handles, I turned it into these guys right here. This, the bag was already with polka dots, so um, that's what it would look like. Right now it's not um, coated with anything. I only kind of cut it in half and glued the, ins glued the top half to the inside, to the bottom. And then um, this is an unfinished one. This is finished. I coated it with Mod Podge and polyurethane, so it's more resistant. It's definitely stronger than this one right here. Um, this one is a uh, napkin, one of those uh, pretty napkins. Uh, some buttons and some ribbon on the ins outside and the inside. Again, this one's uh, pretty strong and you can carry a lot of heavy things actually um, around the house or if you want to give it as a gift, which is what I intend to do with these guys. I think they're pretty good. This one right here, this is also junk mail. They are strips, I turned, um, I cut a lot of strips and then I just braided it, all glued it and braided it all around it, even the bottom. I coated it already, so I think this one came out pretty interesting and colorful. I'd rather leave the inside looking natural so you can actually see it's a recycled item. And, oh, these two guys right here, which are made um, from the same material, paper bags. This one, um, I guess you could use, this, uh, use it as a tissue holder. And this one is also from a napkin. I think it came out pretty cute. You can do so many things with paper and uh, decorate it any way you want to. Some of these guys, I'm planning on lining them with fabric, with some pretty fabric, but I kind of still have to go shopping, so we'll see what I can find. And these are just some of the things that I do, that um, I reuse, I should say, around the house. So I will try my best to post uh, videos on how I make each one. And so in case you're interested, you can you know check them out later. Thank you.